another automatic crafting bench somewhere. Running out of room here. Now, I think I'm gonna put it on over this side. Hmm. What have I got being built here? Can I swap these around? That might be. I keep forgetting what I'm making and where. Um. So. Okay. Never mind. It's it's getting messy, but. Never mind, I can always neaten it up after I've after I've built it. So let's put it there. So we need to get refined iron over to here somehow. Now we can use stone pipes. And come out there. We need a lot more refined iron going uh, into making machine blocks than we do for electric circuits. We need two bits of refined iron for the electric circuits for every solar panel, and that's because we need two electric circuits. And we need eight bits for the machine block. So let's uh, set that ratio. What color have we got? Green. So we'll have two. Or one is to four rather, rather than two is to eight. So we'll put four bits in the green and one bit there, and that should give us the, the right ratio, I think. Okay, let's set up the recipe, which is like so. And okay, we need to go into here. Okay, I don't have a bit of marble on me, so cobblestone will have to do. And power it, and there we go. Okay, um, so process up a bit by using what refined iron we have in our inventory. Okay, that'll do, that'll do. And of course they're just going to pop out. We need to put them like that. Okay, and there's our generator. And last but not least, can't believe it. We've nearly got it. Generator goes. Where does that? Where is that generator? Here we go. And we have a solar panel. Finally. Okay. Little. We have made a mistake though. We need to get another rechargeable battery in our recipe here. And we've filled up with furnaces already, so that's going to overflow. But we'll we'll fix all that up with advanced insertion pipes and I guess we'll probably just either recycle or just send any surplus into a, a big pool of lava to be destroyed. So one more redstone engine to set up and there we go and there we go. Okay let's not worry about the overflow at the moment. Four. Okay, so we got glass overflowing as well. We got holes all over the place. 
but we're making solar panels and we're making them automatically except that we haven't got any more electric circuits or generators coming through why not okay so we need more where's our are these pumping out okay so I need a bit more redstone to come through now I am going to be um, <coughs> making some more quarries at the moment this is all just running off the one quarry but I will be probably maybe running two or three quarries at a time and I will try to, to, to stagger them a bit so that they're at, all at different depths um, you know so that I, I, don't, I don't want basically three quarries running near the surface at the same time because then I'll just be getting a whole lot of cobblestone and dirt which is no use to anyone Okay, so have we got any more? Okay, I need more tin as well. That's the problem. Right, so now we should see some rechargeable batteries coming through into our generator recipe, and out comes our generator into our solar panel recipe. So we're probably missing. Well, we're not missing we just we're not getting the the materials yeah that we need we're not getting the copper cables coming through at the moment and the reason for that let's just check that we okay so most of the copper cables that we do get should be going onto this one uh, we're just not getting very many at the moment. Here comes some rubber. Is there any copper in there? Okay, so we're a bit low on copper. Is, is the problem. Let's just make sure red. So we definitely should be getting copper coming through there if the quarry was picking any up at the moment. So it's probably just a case that it's not. Actually, you can see some copper coming here. Which way is it going to go? Okay, this piece is actually... Oh no, it has gone, it's going into our storage facility. So let's just check on the yellow copper. Yeah, so I should be getting, half of my copper will be going over, over here. Um, it just hasn't happened yet, so that piece is going down there. I saw another piece go down there just before, so the, the next piece of copper that comes along should hopefully go over that way. And... Um, start helping us to make solar panels, of which we're going to need a lot. I, th I think to make a, a high voltage solar array we need about 512 of these or something. Um, which we'll get, we'll get eventually. I do have a lot of copper already and materials in my chest so I, I could uh, speed this process up by using the materials that I've already got. Um, but at the moment I might just let my quarries run and go do other things and uh, well, I'll, I'll get a couple more quarries running, and I'll go and do some other things, and I'll come back in a while and see how this is doing. But anyway, that's uh, I think that's about it for now. I might actually just um, set up a bit of an overflow system, and then we'll call it the end of the episode there. Okay, so I've set our overflow systems up. We have a advanced insertion pipe here so that if uh, <clears throat> the glass or the coal dust section is full the items will go down instead and the same thing over here you can actually see the furnaces going down this pipe here rather than going into our automatic crafting bench and that's because it is full and basically it just uh, oh god damn it okay here we go uh, so that's the glass and the coal dust, and then there's the furnaces there. They join together with an iron pipe, and they just drop straight down into the lava. I think that furnace floating there is uh, one that popped out of the pipe before I set the lava up properly or something, I don't know. I'm not sure why it's floating there. It just, it just is, okay? And uh, that's it. I've also uh, just put a redstone engine to pump our completed solar panels out and it'll pump them into this chest so we're still just waiting on some electric circuits which I think is just uh, we're in a bit of a <coughs> I guess a copper lull at the moment 
Uh, so as soon as we get some... Okay, so we've nearly got... Uh, actually, why is, why is that not... Oh, okay, I see what the problem is. Here we go. We need one more redstone engine. It's a good job I didn't uh, just just leave and uh, go do something else thinking that this was working, because it's not. Okay, so here we go. Now we'll have some, some cables coming out. And some of them... I don't know if it will split the stack or if the whole stack... Yeah, the whole stack of six is going to go in one direction rather than splitting it. Um, hmm, that's strange. Strange. But it should be working now anyway. So, I'm just waiting for some copper, really. So, a quick recap. Uh, if, you, if you're not interested, obviously stop watching. But our rubber trees grow... Um, well, they grow naturally. They're automatically harvested by our red power block breakers. A deployer then replants the sapling, which this deployer over here has uh, obviously run out of saplings. Um, and that one. Oh. Our cat's still uh, spazzing out down there. Somehow a, a skeleton must have died and got in the system as well, somehow. So, let's just fix this up. I, I think I need to make our uh, sapling catching bit more efficient. Um, it's not too often that I have to re refill these deployers, but every now and then they, they tend to run out uh, somehow. Anyway, so our wood goes through some pneumatic tubes underground here, and they come out up the top here into our extractor, where they uh, where the wood is extracted into rubber. The rubber comes out here to be made into cables with our copper, which comes from the pipe down the top. Our cables then come out of this wooden pipe here and are split into two directions. So some of them go towards making rechargeable batteries and some of them towards making electronic circuits. And the, the other components that are needed, so the tin and redstone comes through this pipe up the top here and the refined iron through this pipe at the top here and they all come from over that direction over there. Okay, so our electric circuits come... let's do our rechargeable battery. Actually, our rechargeable battery comes out of this wooden pipe here to be made into a generator. So our refined iron and furnace comes in through the top. Uh, the machine block, sorry. No, just the furnace comes in through the top. The machine block is made here with our refined iron, which comes through the top. And the machine block goes across this wooden pipe into here. And our generator goes into here, where it's combined with our... Uh, um, oh, God. I'm okay, so it's combined with our glass, and our glass comes from our cobblestone, which is macerated into sand, and then smelted into glass here. And any leftover cobblestone is made into our furnace, which is used for our generator. So, did you get all that? Right. Um, I'm, I'm just glad that I've finished it. Uh, I'm going to get some more quarries running, and then hopefully we will start seeing some some solar panels happening. Anyway, thanks for uh, thanks for enduring this. It's um, it's been a challenge, but it's also been fun to build. So thanks for watching. Bye.